Okay, my name's Chris Mello. I'm, uh, I'm based locally, but like all city professionals, I go where the work is. But I am a director, composer, sometimes writer. Uh, I have a long history of in the city, back from the old Everyman days of the early 80s. Uh, so, and I always wanted to work for the Royal Court since it's been redeveloped in the last few years. And when Kevin had this play that he was writing and asked me to look at it, I was really excited to get it. My Fairfield Lady. Well, people will recognise the My Fair Lady of that, and I'm sure they won't be surprised to know that in typical Royal Court style, it's a, there's a Liverpool twist on a very famous story. Um, and it's about a young man who's given the challenge by his mum and dad to produce his Liverpool girlfriend for inspection. It's about a young man who is challenged by his family to produce the very Liverpool girlfriend he said he's got for inspection. Uh, and then all the things that happen when he tries to do that. For me, there's a very lovely scene at, I'm trying not to give too much away, at the wedding which is very, very funny, but has a really beautiful twist in, and I think that probably will remain ultimately my favourite. Come and see it to find out what that twist is. No, you don't need to know anything about the original story. In fact, the original story is Pygmalion, which is a Greek myth about a woman who is, who is allowed to bring someone to life, so even the original is not the original. And so this is taking the story on to a whole new level, hopefully in the audience. Well, uh, Royal Court audiences, they, they, they do love the shows with that energy and that buzz that, that the, the Liverpool twist on famous stories gives, and it has all of that. So definitely come if you, if you love the, that really energetic style that, Liverpool, that, the, uh, that the Royal Court always has. But also, although it's cheeky and a little bit of language in, uh, you can bring your mum. I mean, it's a very warm and human story, so I'm hoping that people will, who used to, who are used to coming to the Royal Court, will go. Well, that was that was different to what I expected, but I loved it. So it's funny, but it's not only funny, and I think that's why I love it, and that's why. It's to be, if I was going to be able to pick any show in the world, it would have to be a new piece of writing because I, I just love adapting things for the first time, working with writers to evolve something new, and and then watching what actors bring to that again. It just, it's the thing I love about theatre, which is that it all changes in the end. The end result is not what anybody started with. So it had to be a new piece, and I think something with a bit of gore, maybe, there was a twist on a, on a murder or a, or, a, or, a, or a twist on a horror, that was, but it also had a comedy twist.